Anything you wish you would have done a little differently in that match at this point in terms of the way you played it tactically or? I wish I would have won. <laughs> um, maybe you can always look back and say, you know, I wish I'd done this. I wish I'd taken this break point or, you know, taken advantage of 30 love. But at the end of the day, um, you know, she, she played better than me today and hats off to that. And, you know, I just need to go back and work hard and it's early still beginning of the year. So um, still have 10 months to make up for this and hopefully it's still going to be a good year. You obviously play all year and work hard and won a lot of matches to get your ranking up where it is to be a top eight seed at a slam. So what's it like getting an uh, opponent who's won two of the last three times here and only the second round? Yeah, I mean, obviously she feels great here. You know, um, I think it's a curse I've gotten here. I've made uh, semis, then quarters, then fourth round, then third round, and this year's second round. So it's kind of gone that way the last few years. So I'm hoping I'm going to break that next year and hopefully uh, um, start going the other way. Um, but, you know, I love this tournament, and I'm so sad to be out already. And obviously um, it was a tough draw for for both of us, but you know, she came out and on top and, and played better. So you believe that luck or bad luck can exist, I guess, in a, in a draw? Yeah, I mean, there's always, you know, a little bit of luck in the draw and sometimes on paper it looks tougher, but you know, it's opponents that you like to play. Sometimes it looks easy, but it's someone that you maybe don't feel comfortable playing. So in the end of the day, um, you know, every draw, I mean, you can see that uh, there's been so many upsets. So, um, you know, there's nothing that comes easy. But at the same time, you know, um, I'm sure I could have had it a little bit easier. <laughs>